Hey guys, it's Rick and welcome back to River Rack. Uh, I took some PTO time and working in the yard and just taking a little break right now. And I figured while I'm taking the break, I wanted to show you our motion sensor alarm system. I see you call it. It is called the guard line. And if you're off grid, if you're a prepper, if you just get tired of people getting in your stuff, you need this. And the reason you need it is because it is battery operated and it's good for up to a quarter of a mile. So you can put your sensor somewhere. Somebody's been creeping around on your property. You can set your little sensor somewhere where they can't see it. It's all battery operated and it will let you know that the creepers in the neighborhood. So you can go take care of business and find out what the hell the creepers doing in your yard. So this little box here is called guard lines, guard line driveway alarm. It's good up to a quarter of a mile. And they say, whether it is or not, I haven't tested it, but I can tell you it goes pretty damn far around the property. It is operated by four AA batteries, or it also comes with the uh, 110 charger that you just plug it right in. And that's usually how I keep it configured. But the, the cool thing is that it's got batteries. So you could take this camping with you, uh, off-grid situations, the power goes out, your system is still up and running. The sensors are all battery operated and you can add up to 16 of them to this unit. The unit is divided into zones. You got uh, one through four and each zone can have four sensors programmed into it. Each sensor will have its own notification sound. So if, if it goes off, say you've got one out in your driveway, it's going to let you know with that sound. The one sound that I picked for my driveway is the horn sound this makes sense helps me remember where it's at um, I when I bought this unit I bought four sensors with this and they work great I've had it over six months it's it's been at least six months since I bought it and I haven't changed the batteries in it yet that's why I actually have it all out right now is it's time to just go ahead and put new batteries in it whether they need it or not because the bad thing about it is the batteries go out you don't really know that they went out so I got a good six months out of it. I'm just going to change them out and we'll start up fresh again. The other thing that we use is the Kitty smoke alarm. This is the intelligent wire free interconnect with the 10 year battery. I have three separate buildings that we kind of work out of. We have our guest cabin, we have our main cabin, and then I have my workshop cabin. And if the smoke alarm goes up there and is if it goes off if there's an issue up there say in my workshop i won't really know until i hear the fire department or somebody's banging on my door because i'm in my room sound asleep this is connected to the smoke detector in my bedroom it's also connected to the smoke detector in our guest cabin so if one goes off all of them go off this is good security for if you have outbuildings um, safety i should say not really security it, it just keeps you safe uh, let you know what's going on. The reason I bought these is the story of the pig and the one-eyed chihuahua. Dottie is our resident neighbor's dog that pretty much lives here most of the time. And a while back, she brought down a little pig friend that she had. And he was cute as all get out when he was little. But he became a bit of a prick as he got older. And the neighbors kept him in the garage. And over the winter, they put a heater in there for him to help keep him comfortable. And I guess he decided it was time to knock it over and just burn the thing down. Had they had one of these in the garage, they probably could have saved the, the, the garage. The pig got out fine. He went to go live on a different farm because he's just, he's going around being mean to everybody and he's just a bit of a prick. Uh, had they had one of these, they wouldn't have lost everything. And unfortunately he didn't have insurance on it either. So he literally lost everything that was in his garage. That concerned me and it, it got me thinking, okay, what am, what are we going to do to prevent that from happening to us? This is a good example. It's the best way to learn is through other people's mistakes. And I learned that. So if you have outbuildings that you might be concerned about or something, I'd recommend one of these. They work great. Uh, it's got little indicators on them. So when it's green, you know everything's cool. If it's yellow, you, that means that there's a problem somewhere. Maybe one of them's not connected. I've never had that issue, but the feature is in there. And if it's red, it'll light up red to let you know that there's an alert. There's something going on that needs your attention. So the Kitty Smoke Alarm Intelligent Wire-Free Interconnect. It's worth it. Uh, these are about 40 bucks. 
I think we paid 45 at a big box store right down there. If you're just a camper or prepper or whatever, I and you want this. You do. You want this. I can take this anywhere with me, and it'll work effectively. You can't beat that for security. You really can't. Uh, cool thing is, is that you can move them around. So if you put it somewhere and, and you find it's not that effective or it keeps getting false triggers, you can relocate it and it works just fine. There's no wiring involved. There's nothing like that. It's super easy, super simple, super fast. So, hey, thanks for taking the time to watch this. Appreciate it. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, whatever it is that makes you happy will make me happy. Have a beautiful day.